Hi, Stefan Svarting here. More and more rumors are showing up on the internet uh, about the coming MacBook Pros. The 2012 MacBook Pros will uh, uh, probably be designed as the MacBook Air. Uh, both the 15 inch, 13 inch and probably a 17 inch will be designed as the MacBook Air. And the rumors also said that they will have the Ivory Bridge uh, chips, uh, CPUs. And the coming MacBook Pros will also have an SSD drive instead of a hard drive, exactly as the MacBook Airs. And they also will only have Thunderbolt and USB ports, exactly as the MacBook Air. So it will be like the MacBook Air, but uh, bigger and maybe more powerful. But the biggest change, the rumor says, is that they will have a Retina display, and that will be incredibly cool. So the resolution could be like 2880 by 1800 pixels or by 2400 pixels. Very high resolution. And they will probably have a killer graphics card from AMD Radeon. And of course, uh, it, they will probably have some better battery and so on. Battery life will be a lot greater. And of course, they will run on the latest OS X version called Mountain Lion. And Mountain Lion will uh, revolutionize everything again because Mountain Lion will merge iOS and OS X even tighter than before. It will be really great to have uh, apps synchronized between your iOS devices and your MacBook Pro. And probably uh, later on in the future, we will have the same on the MacBook Air, of course. Same uh, graphics card, same uh, Ivory Bridge CPUs uh, and uh, Retina display. And personally, i looking forward to the MacBook Air 11 inch with a retina display that will be my next device to buy if apple release one this summer or autumn i will probably buy that because a macbook air 11 inch with retina display will make the device even better than it is now uh, i use my macbook air 11 inch as my main computer i connect it to my 40 inch samsung smart tv when i'm home and when i am mobile i have it with me instead of the ipad because it's have the same weight same size thinner uh, more powerful instant on and everything you need from an ipad but much much more powerful so the macbook air 11 inch is the perfect device for me the perfect device so i am very much looking forward for the next macbook air with an 11 inch retina display that will be great really great so the macbook pro with an air design is really cool but uh, they are too big for me the smallest is 13 inch so i don't think it's so portable as the 11 inch macbook air so I will prefer to buy the MacBook Air 11 inch instead. So I am sure Apple will update the MacBook Air in the future with a Retina display and Ivy Bridge CPUs, better graphics, better battery life and so on. So I will wait for the next MacBook Air instead of the MacBook Pros that coming this year. Uh, of course, they are great and many users will buy the new MacBook Pros, but I think that the MacBook Air 11 inch is the perfect device. You can have it with you all the time. You can use it as your main computer. It's really powerful, really fast, small, light and everything. So a MacBook Air 11 inch with a Retina display running on Mountain Lion is the future. That is the future. So the only devices I will need in the future is my iPhone and the MacBook Air. The iPhone will be my 3G modem, my MiFi, 
and the MacBook Air will be everything. Main computer, mobile device, iPad, everything. Because Mountain Lion will merge iOS with OS X and everything will be great. So my suggestion is to wait for the MacBook Air 11 inch with a Retina display instead of buying the MacBook Pros with Retina display. A lot better device. So that's my thoughts about the coming MacBook Pros and probably the coming MacBook Airs with Retina display. Have a nice day. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. It will be great if you do. Like this video, give it a thumbs up, comment on it, please share it, and so on. Bye.